In this example, we're going to find the highest common factor between 1,281 and 3,965 using the Euclidean algorithm. So the Euclidean algorithm says that the highest common factor of A and B is equal to the highest common factor between A and the remainder R when the division algorithm is applied. So let's have a look at that in action. So the first step is to write 3,965 in terms of 1,281 times some number plus a remainder. So the idea of this is that the remainder must be positive, so we need to multiply 1,281 by a number that gives the product as being less than the 3,965. So to start with, we can multiply it by 3, and this gives, if you put it in a calculator, a remainder of 122. So that means that 3,965 is equal to 1,281 times 3 plus 122. Now the next step, we have to move the algorithm along. So next we take the 1,281 and that, that equal 122, which comes from the previous remainder, times some number plus a remainder. So 1,281 can be written as 122 times 10, and that will equal 1,220 with a remainder of 61. So we apply the algorithm again. So the 122 moves down. So we have 122 is equal to 61, which comes from the previous remainder, times some number with a remainder. So in this case, 122 can be written as 61 times 2 with a remainder of 0. And now that we've got a remainder of 0, this algorithm says that the highest common factor between 1,281 and 3,965 is the previous non-zero remainder. So in this case, the highest common factor is 61. So we can write the highest common factor of 1,281 and 3,965 is equal to 61. And you can also check that on a calculator or using prime decomposition.